Hello again from the newsroom. Another threatened anti-government demonstration in Bangkok has fizzled out, though tensions there are still high. There are claims tonight the death toll in three days of violence is as high as 12,000. The government claims no more than 40 protesters have been killed. In other news, David Wayne Tamahiri's double murder conviction was upheld by the Court of Appeal today, but his lawyers say they're not giving up. And Canterbury loose forward Andy Earle has been suspended by his union for two weeks after a blow which broke the jaw of Irishman Richard Wallace. And finally tonight, fish bites dog. Yes, in the Netherlands, a Staffordshire Bull Terrier needed six stitches after being savaged by a giant pike. The dog's owner says the razor-toothed fish lunged as the terrier chased a stick through the water. True story. The news in detail in tonight on 1 at 10.30.